Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. So today is the Aera. It's life just a game. Uh, what's it called? Dawa program. And this is the first time I'm going to participate. I'm going to make some videos for you guys. And I will go there, we'll do like public Dawa on the street. And uh, hopefully, we'll invite people to Islam. And some people will accept. And then some people, they will give it a thought as they go through their life. So it's an important part of the Dawa also to go out in the public and not just stay online and stuff right so inshallah that's what we're going to be doing today so uh, i'll make some videos to show you guys what i'm doing so in, i'm in abuja right now and uh the dawa thing in nigeria is in many parts but this one is in abuja so i'm going to go and join the guys there inshallah we're going to have a good time salam alaikum guys I just came to the Dawa place I think I came a little bit too late and uh, most people have already gone because I had to go for uh, what's it called physio but alhamdulillah the brothers have been here they have been doing amazing work I think now a lot of people have gone and there's not much people left here right now but alhamdulillah we still have we can still I will take some flyers so you can see these are the flyers the brothers are sharing and uh, I'll take some of them and share this probably to some Jabi Lake Abuja. Inshallah, I will come out with this guy's more. I will go to other locations and stuff. Hey guys, Salam Alaikum. We just went out and we discussed with two people. One guy, his name was Ezekiel, and the other one, Tami. And we had, we shared with, gave them the message of Islam. One of them, we gave him the Quran, and the other one, we gave her. Uh, uh, the girl we gave out the Quran, but the other guy they all listened well. So Alhamdulillah, we did our uh, one of the tasks of sharing Islam to people. No arguments. We just presented our own case, and Alhamdulillah they received it well. So Alhamdulillah. So in, next time maybe I'll come earlier and join the brothers, and uh, maybe I'll be able to inshallah. So anyway, uh, we are about to round up now for today, and I'll be going on. So see you guys later. Assalamu alaikum. Sensitize ourselves and give a very good reminder so that we can purify our, our intention and be sincere in what we do. And Alhamdulillah, uh, we went out, we engaged the people, and uh, I think we resolved, as, you know, resulted in you know, the conversation around the world because uh, we divided ourselves into three teams uh, one headed by myself, Brother uh, Salam headed by one, Brother uh, Habib headed by one. Uh, Sister Baba to head so four teams and I have been uh, spread ourselves across. In fact, myself, I have to exhaust the team. Uh, my team ran to the extreme end, then we came back again. And when we are trying to engage people, they will say, Oh, we have seen your pamphlet, we've seen your pamphlet. Meaning, other team members have you know, reached out to them before. Alhamdulillah, and the team came back. Uh, we're trying to get the reports and the feedback from them before the past show, before our leader came. Subhanallah. <laughs> 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 uh, Alhamdulillah. Um, Jazakullah khair and everyone. Uh, one of the most important and crucial things is for Allah to accept what we have done today. Everything that Allah did not accept is like we have wasted our entire time. But inshallah, for the sake of the intention we have, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give us the good in this life and even in the next, inshallah. Secondly is that, alhamdulillah, 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 you have come and been part of the team today. For those of you who are coming for the first time, we welcome you. 
and we want to make you know that if you have been in this team, even if it is one day, you don't want to leave again. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. As long as your intention is sincere, wallahi, you want to continue. Because you will be amazed how many people are wanting to hear about Islam. You'll be amazed how many people are not really having access to a Muslim to share Islam with them. And then you start wondering, am I fair to myself? Am I fair to them that I'm not coming to tell them about Islam? That's the question all of us ask ourselves. And every sincere Muslim, the answer to that question is, for me to be fair, I have to come and continue to invite them to Islam. So this is something I want to congratulate all of you that are here for the first time. You have come to meet a team that is serious with da'wah and a team that will continue to give da'wah inshallah to the day of our last prayer. Yeah. That's it. The third thing, my brothers and sisters, is that this is you being here. There are other non there are other non-Muslims outside after we leave this place. Our da'wah for us does not end in this place. Our entire existence of why we are here in the, on this earth, the life itself, does not end here. Any place we find ourselves, so all the brothers who are here with us for long, they know that we are like a walking machine, uh, walking our machine as we call ourselves. If you go to my car, if you go to his car, if you go to his house, if you go to their house, you go, you see our pamphlet, Qur'ans, or even you see them engaging people in their offices. That is the way Allah has made us because we are part of a group that will continue to spread Islam in any way. So even after we leave this place, our intention is to see that the da'awah continues in your respective locations. The question now is, is life just a game? That is where we are right now. Is life just a game? We Muslims know the answer. What about the non-Muslims? Do they? No, they don't. Let me ask us a simple question. And I've asked this question more than two times. If, for example, we today see somebody who is catching fire and he comes, we rush to this place, what's the first thing we are going to do? To quench the fire on him? Did we ask whether he is from our tribe? Did we ask if he was the same profession as us? We didn't ask any of those questions. The empathy within our hearts wanted us to what? To quench the fire. Then we talk about any other thing, right? The same thing we know that if anybody dies upon this path, not knowing the essence of his life, not knowing the purpose of his life, please, where is he going to? If he dies upon not knowing, he's dying upon the path that he is completely leaves Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Where is he going really if he dies upon that state? He's going to Jahannam. May Allah protect all of us. From that. So if we know that the fire of Jahannam is forever, unlike the fire of this world, which should we give more emphasis upon? The emphasis should be on the one that we help him in the journey in the hereafter. So when we are seeing all our brothers and sisters here, we should look at them with empathy and see that we need to give them the hour. We need to make them understand the essence of life. Why are we here? Is it just as they, we see every brother and sister here playing games and that's all? They go back and the life continues and is a cycle? No. There is a bigger, bigger purpose to our life. And that is why we as Muslims, every one of us, we must do this. We must continue this. And inshallah, even though we didn't get any shahada from today, it is a massive success because we have decided to start something beautiful in the hearts of these people we engage today. They could go on and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will get them to take shahada. Meanwhile, me and you by that time, we are resting or we are sleeping or we are even dead. Allahu Akbar. So my brothers and my sisters, Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah. Please and please, we know there is a lot of behind the scenes that we'll be doing, asking you to make some report. We are pleading your patience. Sometimes we have to do those things. So please bear with us when we ask you to give some information. And inshallah ta'ala, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give us ease in everything we do. Mm -hmm. I pray I've answered all the team once a bit to come. <laughs> Amen. 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 Amen.